So I'm so excited about showing you these two new strollers from Thule. I've never done char a chariot review and I was checking on YouTube and there's very little about this. So, so glad you found me. So I'm going to show you the chariot light in the single variety and the chariot cross in the double variety. The cross is a sort of a more premium version of the chariot type strollers. Um, this comes in a single, this comes in a double, but um, in this particular moment, I'm going to just show you these kind of like side by side so you get the picture about them. So what are these strollers? Okay, these are all weather strollers and they can be used with skis. They can be used as a bike to be put on the back of a bike and they can be used as a normal stroller, just with a four wheel stroller, and you can get a conversion kit to turn this into a jogging stroller. So the idea about this, of these strollers, is that you can use them in lots of different varieties. So you'll probably end up, when you first have your baby, with a, uh, maybe a Nuna Mix Next, or an Upper Baby Vista, or maybe a little Baby Zen Yo-Yo, and this would be, in my opinion, like a supplemental stroller for those who are living a really active, lifestyle. And so here, let me just show you these strollers. Let's start, start with the Thule light over here. So small wheels on the front, large, super large wheels on the back for extra mobility. And so you can really get around, especially in things like snow. Like I said, you can add a conversion kit to this to turn this into a jogging stroller. But right now you can see this in the, in the four wheel variety. So the reason why you want a four wheel variety is because maybe you did take this on a bike um, and then you want to like walk around for the day. We're here in Massachusetts. So imagine if you went to say like Martha's Vineyard and you wanted to take your chariot light on a bike trail with you. And then you want to like want to walk around town. You could easily convert this from a bike to a walking stroller, which is pretty awesome. Um, they have this little conversion kit, which you can just basically push right into this slot right here and it, it attaches to the back of a bike. Unfortunately, I don't have a bike to show you, but it attaches very, very easily. So where do you put your baby? How does that particularly work? So let me show you about this really improved enhanced like ventilation and like this all weather variety. So really good weather protection on the top of the stroller, which you could just remove by sort of like un like little, little bungee type situations, little elastics that go around the bottom. And then you like unzip this right here. Oh, there's also this, it's kind of like a dream drape type situation again. Um, if you're running in the sun or the baby gets hot or even for cold, you have this nice kind of protection. It just clips right off. So, so, so nice. Really, really high quality. The finishes on this are unbelievably high quality. And you open these up and you pop these out, pop, pop. Again, and now you can put your baby in here. Um, it comes with a little flag. So if you are putting this on the back of a bike, you can pop in the little flag on the back so that you can have people see you for extra enhanced safety. Speaking of safety, it comes with little flashing lights and there are these really great reflectors. So you know that it is super safe. But you put the baby or the child right into the seat this is like a six months plus type of a thing, or this holds up to 75 pounds in the single variety, the double up to 100 pounds with two kids, as I'll show you in a second. So um, really nice five port harness, super safe little pockets. So when your baby's in there or child's in there, you could put their sippy cups and their goldfish crackers or trail mix or whatever you would eat. Probably trail mix with a Thule, right? Trail mix, exactly. Um, and then you could um, just pop the baby in and go out for the day. So. Child's gonna be super comfortable in here. Very, very nice. And you can just put all these things back. Unzip that, zip, zip. Okay, but Ellie, what about folding this thing down and taking this around? So a couple things. Number one is when you do add sort of the skis and the bike variety, what you do is you uh, open this little sort of really, this little, do hickey, open that up, and then you actually put the wheels on the top. So you can store it right there on the top right away, and so you don't like lose your components and your pieces. And like I say, you put this back on. And now, 
um, to fold it down. So um, I have a small hatchback and I was able to get both the double and the single in my car on the way to filming today. So I was like kind of worried about that. Um, so there are a number of different ways you can do this. For the most compact store, the best thing to do probably is to take the back wheels off. Now you don't have to do that, but to take the back wheels off is very, very simple. Push a little button, remove it. I would stick it inside the actual stroller if you want very small storage, but just in general, if you're just like popping in the back of your car, your minivan, um, really, really easy to do. So um, again, there's adjustable handlebars right here. Push this all the way forward. And you'll see here, there's a little side that cut a little safety and there's a memory button. So open the little safety, push the memory button, push. And there's a little, um, it's gonna go from red, uh, from green to red. And then you push the little button on the right and then you fold it down like that. So not the smallest thing in the world, but like I said, if you take off the wheels, one, well that wheel come out, two, then you can see it's very compact or relatively compact for the car. So it definitely will fit. Push this in. And there's a little uh, latch on the side to open it up. So just open it up and click open, click, click back open. And you are good to go. Um, for the double, um, very similar to the single, but something I really wanted to point out about this is that they have this unbelievable storage in the back. So it attaches right, it comes included, it attaches so nicely, and all you do is open this up and you can put your stuff for the day right there into the back of the uh, Chariot Cross. The fabrics are so, so nice. For 2021, um, Thule, like with even the, if you check out my um, review of the Urban Glide um, as well, which I just did, um, you'll see that in terms of the fashions, they've really um, upgraded the fashions really beautifully. Um, if you're wondering, this is the Alaska, this like frost blue Alaska, and this is the agave. Um, love agave. Um, let's talk and show you how the, um, the two seats work on the double, like very similar to the single. What you do is you just un hook this in the front, pull it up, clip these off, and zip, zip. Great ventilation. If you're gonna use this in the summer, it's just gonna have, the air just gonna breeze right through for the children, they'll be so comfortable, and they're two seats side by side. Um, the, both the chariot, um, the Chuli Chariot Cross and the Chuli, Chuli Chariot Light are available to buy from us for Magic Beans with free shipping. Oh, and if you like this video, please give it a like and don't forget to watch more videos on Magic Beans videos. I will see you at the next video.